it is a chilly one today guys and a windy one welcome back to another episode we are heading out to go fishing right now it is about 35 degrees last night there was a big cold front that came through actually yesterday um, where it went from being 60 degrees to now last night we actually got a little bit of snow um, accumulation was only like a quarter inch or so and it already is all gone because of and now it's 35 degrees so it all melted but it is still cold it is windy 20 mile per hour winds gonna be a little bit rough out in the water today but we're going to meet with a few of my buddies that i met this year for coming um i don't think you guys have seen that a video from them yet because one day we only got like three birds didn't make a video out of it so didn't figure you guys would want to see something with only three birds but what we're gonna be doing like i said we're going to meet him he's got a boat for walleye saw guy crappie all that different stuff that i don't fish for so he's got a boat that he fishes for all of that stuff in so we're gonna go meet him hop in his boat with him and hopefully get on some fish so let's go get him that i just stepped on did i just break it my charger oh no they're good it may be a little bit dented but it's good you can see on the graph that there's fish everywhere down there that one. you need a net do what nope <laughs> what do that have to be 15 is that just vertical chicken? Yep. There still looks like there's something up towards the top near that five. Yeah, there is. It's swimming. Casey has one. Did it That may be a keeper. Yeah, I think it is. Dang, so I'm the only one that hasn't caught one yet. Yeah, I didn't even know you had one on. You just said, oh, can I get a net? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that one? Yeah. Oh, a better one? Yeah. yeah, he does. It's a better one. Yeah. Got him. I was trying to bring it in because I thought we were moving, so I started reeling and he grabbed it. Oh, oh there's one. Oh my gosh. It? Yeah, I was just dragging it and it hit it. I didn't think it was a fish at first. <laughs> and then it was swimming to the side. Did you? Oh, you just foul hooked him. <laughs> the time I come here for bass, which was the first time I came here, I could catch saw guy, but not a freaking bass. <laughs> and now I'm catching. Do what? Now, now I'm just trying to freaking catch one. White bass. <laughs> Hey, I finally There's got a, a fish. Bass. I didn't even know they had white bass here. God, I hate white bass. They're, they freaking wiggle so much. <laughs> this thing won't stop. Really? I didn't even know they had white bass here. Go on. Oh, 
well, I'm not skunked anymore, but I still freaking caught a bass when I'm trying to catch saw guy. That's just my luck, even though it's not largemouth. Hey, there's a toothy one. He was right underneath the boat. That thing's probably going to be under, isn't it? No. He was like 12. <sighs> Do what? You said that's crappie? There's something hit it. Not the bobber, but my fiveies. There's a fish. Uh, it's not a bad one. It's probably a keeper. Nah. Maybe. Fourteen and a half. Of course. See you, buddy. I got hit twice right there, though. Right underneath that pontoon. Oh, like just. Over there. Yeah. I cast it. I was right near the pontoon when it landed, and it hit it once right, like as soon as it hit. So there has to be more over there. Oh, there's a big fish, whatever that is. It, it may be a carp or something. No I don't know, dude. It just came up and belly rolled. I think I may have foul hooked it. <laughs> it was in between those docks right there. Oh, right over here. Where... I don't know what it is. Maybe it's a big saw guy. freaking shad yeah it's a giant shad oh, it right in his seat right in the middle of his seat all right you can let him go what in the world that's the biggest freaking shad i've ever seen Oh, there's a big fish. That's fighting like a bass almost. <laughs> hey, it's it's right over here to the left of that red pontoon. Probably, I don't care. This thing feels like a saw guy. What? This feels like a saw guy. It's staying down and you know like how they just go side to side. I just completely foul hooked it. Oh my gosh. They're over there underneath that red pontoon. Yeah. Because <laughs> that's the second cast. <laughs> nope. Why do I keep on keep catching the small fish? Tree growing in Florida is maybe the deadliest tree. <laughs> what in the world? I need to figure out how to do that for my phone because that would be handy. Oh, there's a fish. <laughs> it was right there beside the boat. That has to be. <laughs> Fifteen and a quarter. <laughs> All right. It's because of it's duck season. Yeah. 
Really? There's a fish. That feels like a better one. Maybe. No, it's probably small. It's right here by the boat. Oh, you make it. He's gonna be if he does, he'll be right at the limit. 14 and 3 quarter. Do what? That's the width being stretched. <laughs> it was actually probably like 14 and a half. <laughs> bad that these things keep on freaking completely swallowing this and now there's blood on the back deck It got too dark to film last night, so we just turned off the cameras. We ended up only catching one or two more fish after dark. Typically, they said that they can get on a good bite after dark, but it just happened to not be that night. So we had a good time out there. We got, I think, four or five keeper uh, saw guy total. And we caught a bunch of fish too, which you guys saw. I think we caught probably 15 to 20 fish total. So we enjoyed the night, caught quite a few fish, and just enjoyed, enjoyed everything last night. Thank you for Smitty for taking me out last night and Casey for letting me go with them and showing me the saw guy and crappie fishing out there. I don't think we caught any crappie last night. We caught a white bass and then saw guy and I, then a shad, I think. That's about it. But it was fun. It was cold. It's even colder right now. It's like 30 degrees out and it's snowing. So anyways, thank you guys for watching the video. Hopefully you enjoyed that content. We will be doing more videos like that and doing some catch and cooks here soon. So stay tuned for that. It's only getting started. We're going to be trying to make fishing content for you guys all winter long. But with that being said, we will see you guys in the next one.